Joel, you're not a gay teacher. You're just a teacher. I just see you as a teacher. I just see you as Joel. I just see you as you. I just see you. What I hear people say, what my head does, and what I hear, in order for me to accept you, you need to fit into my world. In order for me to accept you, you need to fit into my world. Hey friends, I'm Joel Kurleski, the super brave teacher. If you are new to the channel, welcome, welcome. This is me sending you love. This is the Super Rape Teacher channel. This is me tipping Google and YouTube in a radically positive and accepting way by making at least 100 videos to say, guess what? I'm here, I'm an out and proud kindergarten teacher, and I'm not going anywhere. And little by little, we're gonna share more stories and get the word out that we matter, that we need to make it better today. Win today. And if you're not new to this channel, thank you. You're awesome, keep coming back for more, keep coming back for more, keep doing what you do, which is like this channel, share this channel, do all the things you do. It makes a difference, so thank you. Today I'm gonna pick apart that phrase, I, boom. Today I'm gonna pick apart that phrase, I don't see you as a gay teacher, I just see you as a teacher. I don't see you as a gay Joel, I just see you as Joel, which is a beautiful thought. So if you think that sometimes, or if you had said that, thank you. I know you are doing your absolute best to love and accept me how I am, so I hear that, and I accept that, and that is okay because I accept you, and you are more than okay, okay? That being said, this is my story, and this is how I hear it, and how I wanna share for you what I need, and my guess is, if I'm feeling this way, there are a lot of other LGBTQ plus folks out there who might be feeling the same way. Maybe not, maybe so. so Get ready to learn something new with me, okay? It is amazing how often I can relate to and empathize with other minority groups. Now, I just said empathize with and relate to. I did not say that I get their struggle or I get their story. I do not get your struggle or your story. But I will say that that phrase, for example, like, I don't see color, I just see you. I don't see, mm, I just see you. It's so similar to how many times LGBTQ plus folk like me hear, I don't see that you're a gay teacher, I just see you. I don't see that. And let me tell you where I have an issue with it. I have an issue with it for myself because I am a gay teacher. For me, I have tried so long to take out this part of me, this part of me who is a gay man, and say, you know what? I'm gonna overextend myself in this other part of my life so that you don't notice that I am gay. But what I realize is, wait, it's not just like 90% of the day I'm Joel and 10% of the day I'm gay. All of my day is gay. All of my day I am me and who I am is a gay person. So when you take out the gay and you just see me, you don't fully see me because I am a beautiful out and proud gay kindergarten teacher. I am an out and proud beautiful gay man who has a hair going like this. <laughs> and when you do that, you are minimalizing me. You are, and I'm gonna say it, dehumanizing me because you are taking out a beautiful, beautiful part of me. So when we do the same thing for people of different colors, and we say, wait a second, you, I don't see your color, I just see you, you're saying, wait a second, I'm gonna deny that you are who you are and that with that comes beauty and struggles and all that stuff in between. So I'm going to say what I need right now, and that is any time you wanna take out part of anybody, say, oh, I don't see that of them, I just see this of them, you are trying to put me into your world for you. So when you say, so if you're, for example, a, a teacher like me, and you say, I don't see you as a gay teacher, I just see you as a teacher, you're trying to say, you know what, to fit into my world, I can relate to you being a teacher, so I'm gonna just put you in that box. Joel, teacher, I don't see you as a, a gay man, I just see you as a man. Maybe said by another man like, yep, I get that. And we start to minimize people and it's natural, I get it. But when you do that, you take away the person. And my guess is, you're an awesome, kind, brave, beautiful human being, just like me. 
And my guess is you're also doing the absolute best you can every second of every day, just like me. So something you're gonna do to make it a little better today, to make it better today for people like me, is to watch the words you say and to use words like, you know what, Joel? I don't get it all the time, but I see that you're a gay teacher. You know what, Joel? I don't get it. I don't get you being a gay man, but I see it and I value you and I appreciate you. And I'm gonna try to do the same for you. So when I come in with my stories and I'm like, let me tell you my struggle, I get to say, wait a second, tell me your story. Tell me your struggle. I wanna hear that too because I wanna make sure that I'm not missing you in that story. Yes, I can relate to you in certain ways, but I do not get you on other ways. So please let me know, let me know. So that's what we're gonna do, friends. We are going to listen to each other we are not going to minimalize and dehumanize people. And we're going to embrace all of each other because all of us are amazing. So there you go. Was, that wasn't that hard, was it? Right? Like this. Like this. You got it. Subscribe. You got it. You got it. Do whatever you do to get the word out that things like this, these little micro lecciones, these little mini lessons are important because we need to collectively be there for each other and we need to empathize with each other and hold each other and I'm rambling because I just love you guys. Thank you for watching this channel. Do what you do. You are amazing. You are wonderful just for being you. And I'm going to say to myself, Joel, you are amazing. You are enough just for being you. Just for being a gay teacher. I see you, Joel. You are gay and that is awesome. And if you are gay, if you are lesbian, bisexual, transgender, anything in between, fellow queer folk, you are enough just being you. Have a great day.